Otherwise, it's going well. We just stick to our game plan, you know, uh, get up and down the floor, pass up the, the open shots to get wide open shots for our teammates. How enjoyable is it to end the season here in the NCAA tournament? It's very enjoyable, you know. My first time with the Division II, uh, you know, uh, making the tournament, so it's going to do very well. Brian, um, if I can get you, what are going to be the keys to tomorrow's game to, to pick up a W here in the opening round? Uh, first of all, we just got to defend, guard our, guard our individual position, and then just the offense, looking for the open man every, every time, getting shot every possession. Let me ask you also, this is your third year here at Francis Marion. How enjoyable is it for you to end your final two years here in the NCAA tournament? It's crazy. When, when I first came in here, I never knew I would be here, so it's just a surreal experience. Brandon, if I can just get you now. Um, Obviously, last year, we lost three starters off the team. And probably there were some doubts among some people, you know, whether we'd be back here in the NCAA tournament this year. And here we are with another, with one more win than we had last year. You know, how gratifying is that to end the season here in the NCAA? Uh, that was one of our goals before the season, is make it back to the NCAA tournament. Like Ross said last year, we're going to come right back and make it to the tournament this year. And how does it feel, you know, you two have been here before. Uh, how were you able to talk with the newcomers and all and explain to them, hey, we don't want to, to make this a quick trip. We want to stick around and play a couple games. Uh, just have a, have a lot of patience with the freshmen and just talk to, them th talk to them through it and just have a good game every day. Okay, Coach, we're about 24 hours away from game time here, the opening round of the NCAA tournament. Uh, what's the status of the team right now after your practice today? Every, everybody's healthy. Uh, Winston Hill is banged up a little bit with his, with his uh, ankle, but he looked better today. So I think he'll be able to give us good, significant minutes tomorrow, and that's going to be important because he had a good game at Augusta. But everybody's ready to go. Everybody's ready to go. We've put all the practice in. Lord knows we've been practicing long enough since October. So uh, we're ready for the, the ball to be tipped up tomorrow and uh, see what we can do. What's the keys to, to picking up a win in the first round tonight? Augusta's much like Pembroke in that we've got to hold our own on the boards. They're a great rebounding team. So we've got to eliminate any second-chance points that they have. And then, you know, other than that, I think then we can play some pretty good uh, half-court defense. We've got to stop them in the half-court, but we have done that pretty effectively this year. Obviously, on the offensive end, we need to hit some shots. You know, it's so important for us to hit our shots. Um, you know, so a lot of it will depend on how we're hitting, uh, if we're, we're stroking that thing. Um, you know, but I think we will. You know, I think it'll be a great game. I think it's going to be a good game tomorrow. Two good teams. Obviously, Augusta is very hot right now, but... You know, I, I, I like the matchup, and, and I like our chances. Obviously, every coach's goal is to be playing in the, in the NCAA tournament during the season. How gratifying is it to do this for the second year in a row? Oh, it's great. I, I'm so happy for our seniors, Ryan Harris and Brandon and those guys who were with Dietrich Browning last year. I'm so happy they were able to experience it last year, and then this is just such a bonus because, you know, going into this year, we didn't know if we'd be able to make it again or not, but the guys believed, and – just so happy for all of our players, but particularly our, our three seniors. Well-deserved, well-deserved this year. And I think some kudos do go to you and your coaching staff. You meshed in three new starters. You went from basically a rotation of seven players at the start of the year to now where you're going nine or ten deep. We are. We, we felt like we had to keep people fresh. And, then yeah, the guys, the young guys, the freshmen, they have come in and they've done a great job. You know, so – that has helped us this year, but it'll only help us uh, even more down the future with these young guys getting this kind of experience. I want our freshmen to, to get a taste and a feel for this environment so they can let everybody know next year that comes in, you know, what it's all about and, and, and work hard, see if we can do this thing again. Make this, make this an annual date at the NCAA tournament.